What's up YouTube? Today I'll be showing you how to make a prestige system using commands in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Let's get to it. Alright, first we're going to make a scoreboard. I'm going to call it prestige. Dummy. Next we're going to set display our scoreboard and we're going to make it below name. So when you look at a player, as you can see it below their name, how much they prestiged. Alright, next Give yourself a command block. We're gonna place it, make it repeating, always active. And we're gonna start with the effects for our prestige first. So, effect at all. Scores equals prestige with anyone with the level one or above. And our first prestige effect will be village hero. Infinite, one, true. All right, to make this as easy as possible, if you don't know how to copy command blocks with commands inside of them, all you have to do is crouch, pick block, and as you can see, our command block has data in it. So if you place it, the commands are still here. But for this one, we're gonna make it a different effect. So we're gonna do level zero, paste, with anyone to level two or above. And you can just copy that one again. And this time we're gonna do haste one with a level above three. Copy that. You just keep copying these. You can do any effect you want, it's up to you. This time we're gonna do health boost level zero with anyone with the prestige above four. We can copy that again. Health boost level one, so that'll be four extra hearts prestige above five and that's that's all the prestige is going to go all right now i'm going to show you how to make a level cap we're going to do repeating always active and we're going to do another effect command at all scores what i'm doing first is when a level cap happens it's gonna take away one level but i don't want that one level to be wasted for players so i'm gonna give everybody who breaches that level cap a saturation effect so instead of scores, we're going to put level minimum 101. So if anyone who has the level 101 or above, it will activate this command. Saturation, one second, true. So that should immediately like recover all your hunger. We're going to copy that command, make this one conditional and a chain command block. And instead of saturation, we'll do instant health. So it also instantly regenerates player's health. We're going to make another chain command block conditional. This time we're going to do execute as at all level minimum 101 at S. And we're going to do a place sound command just so players can hear that they reached level max. We're going to do respawn, anchor, deplete at S. Just so the, uh, the only person who can hear it is themselves and we're going to do players coordinates so it'll be on their position one it doesn't actually control the volume it's just the distance players can hear it and then pitch two all right after that we're going to place another chain command block this time we're going to do a title raw command but you don't have to type this i'll just i'll just put this in the description so you can just copy and paste it title raw command that will let you know that max level has been reached all right the last chain command block here is going to be xp negative one level so one l at all and level minimum 101 so it should reset back to 100 that's what i'm gonna set the level max is 100 here all right i'm gonna summon a npc this is what i'm gonna use to give people prestige so my npc looks like this i'm actually gonna copy and paste another command block and this command is also in the description for copy and paste. It's a lot to type here, but basically it's scoreboard players add at initiator. So whoever actually presses the button, which is nice. Level minimum 100, prestige one. So that will actually give your prestige. And then execute as a initiator, level minimum 100. Scores prestige one and above. At S, run play sound. So this will be like another indication that you actually press the button we're going to do another execute as at initiator run pl another place sound command then we're going to do 
XP minus 100 levels and add initiator level minimum 100 scores and yeah it's it's basically the same thing and we're gonna also select button mode for this and we're gonna call this one prestige all right I got all my command blocks named it's time to actually show how this thing works all right I'm gonna give myself a hundred levels as you can see I got a hundred levels and now I'm gonna prestige as you can see, I got the effect of Village Hero. I forgot to do something real quick. If your commands are spamming like that, just uh, put Game Rule Command Block Output. False. You should stop spamming everything now. I'm also going to show how this level cap works. So if I, if I give myself the max level here, then give myself a little bit of XP. It resets back to level 100. Alright, now that I have a little bit less health and a little bit less hunger, I'm going to breach the level cap again. And as you can see, like all my health and hunger came back. Alright, I'm here with my alternate account. I'm going to show you the prestige system from another perspective. Okay, this is what it looks like when another player has prestige. It sh actually shows that they prestige below their name. Pretty nice, pretty nice. That's basically it for the video. If you like the video, smash the like button. And I'm also trying to find some builders for a Hunger Games map. If anyone's interested and if they're good at building, uh, join the Discord and let me know if you're down to build some maps and stuff, you know. But that'll be pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching and see you later.